hello students so here is the second video of chapter number 5 the four domains of the earth in that chapter we have studied that environment consists of four spheres the first one was lithosphere second we have studied hydrosphere third atmosphere and fourth one is biosphere so here i am with the exercises solved exercises of this chapter kindly listen it properly so first one is fill in the blanks our earth is a unique planet answer is planet the mantle consists of molten rocks dash are one of the oldest modes of transportation what is the answer water ways water ways plants use dash in the process of photosynthesis which gas it was used carbon dioxide around dash per percent of earth water is frozen in glacier and ice caps we have studied in the chapter it was 75% now true false living things breathe in oxygen and breathe out helium is it correct why do we used to breathe out it is carbon dioxide so it is false air is a mixture of only oxygen carbon dioxide no there are many other gases too so it is false the mantle is the innermost layer of the earth no it is middle layer false the earth is also known as frozen planet no false ocean currents influence the climate of particular place yes it is true now come to the choose the correct option the thinnest layer of the earth out of four option core mantle crust none of these it is crust all natural resources of earth such as oil gas and minerals are found in hydrosphere atmosphere lithosphere or none of this answer is lithosphere what percent of earth is covered with water 97% 75% 71% 4% 71% which is the most important gas for our survival nitrogen argon oxygen or helium it is oxygen here it is a mess the following i have written in front of uh the in front of um, i have written the answers in front of that statement only so kindly listen uh, you can understand properly so lithosphere is the from lithosphere out of this option is crust precipitation refers to rain hydro refers to water marine life refers to sea and atmosphere refers to protective shield so this was uh, of the mess the following you can write down in front of that word only now come to the question answers name the four spheres of the environment we have studied environment consists of four spheres that is lithosphere hydrosphere atmosphere and biosphere now what makes the lithosphere so important we have studied in the paragraph all the natural resources of the earth such as oil gas and minerals are found in the lithosphere which makes it so important come to the question number 3 how is hydrosphere is an important part of the earth hydrosphere is the sphere of water we have studied in the chapter water is very important for the existence of life on the earth water is needed for several purposes such as drinking washing cultivation of crops manufacturing things in industries etc that's why hydrosphere is an important part of the earth now come to the describe the composition of atmosphere atmosphere mainly consists of nitrogen which is 78% and oxygen which is 21% other gases such as carbon dioxide hydrogen and other rare gases such as argon krypton and helium are found in traces i am repeating again atmosphere mainly consists of nitrogen which is 78% and oxygen which is 21% other gases such as carbon dioxide hydrogen and other rare gases such as argon krypton and helium are found in traces what is an ecosystem all the things of a particular area functioning together as a unit with their environment makes an ecosystem this is the answer all the living things of a particular area functioning together as a unit with the environment makes an ecosystem name the three layers of the earth the three layers of the earth 
three layers of the earth are crust, mantle, and core. The three layers are. I am repeating again. You have studied in the paragraph. Okay, first paragraph itself that there are three layers of the earth. The first one cray, crust, middle one mantle, and an earmost core. So here we finish your question answers and exercises of this chapter. Kindly write down in your copy. Learn it. I will be again. Come back with your chapter number six. Till then, kindly complete your work. Thank you, students.